Deborah is giving 150 South African girls a chance for a brighter future. Her school for girls opened in Africa, fulfilling a long-cherished dream and a promise to Nelson Mandela. This has been a long time coming. This is not just, for me, um, you know, some small idea. This is a supreme moment of destiny for me. I've been coming to this day my entire life. The school will be known as the Oprah Winfrey Leadership Academy for Girls. It is located south of Johannesburg. I believe that education is an open door to all life, a sustainable bridge to all that is possible. Education is my bridge to self-esteem. Former President Mandela was among the guests at the opening ceremony. Tina Turner, Mary J. Blige, Mariah Carey, Chris Tucker, and Spike Lee also attended the event. You know, everything Oprah does is next level. She's uh, just one of those anointed people who can change the world, and um, we don't have very many of those people left. Winfrey claimed that educating young girls will help in the fight against HIV and AIDS. And because AIDS is a pandemic in this country, I, begin, I believe that we have to begin to change the pandemic by education. The $40 million academy aims to give poor girls a quality education. No easy task in a country where schools are struggling to overcome the legacy of apartheid. Eventually, the school will accommodate 450 girls. Margie Zaraleta, The Associated Press.